Okay. I suppose I'll get Kill Phil Part 2 out of the way. After I save at uh, my drug site in Vice Point, if I can get there. So if you thought Purple Haze was tricky, wait till you see Kill Phil Part 2 Bloody Hell. Totally and utterly spun out of control right there. There was nothing I could have done to have corrected that oversteer, unfortunately. Come on, get on the road, not the pavement. Shut up, please. And because that took quite a while, I'll BRB. Okay. See, it's just all about uh, finding the best and most reliable strategies. That's all, right. I would grab a fast car like an Infernus before starting Kill Phil Part 2, but... Uh, that mission's opening cutscene is a cinematic cutscene. And cinematic cutscenes make your vehicle disappear. I know the Deluxo, which spawns outside, is fairly quick, but I would rather have something quicker. Okay, fingers crossed, this one isn't going to be very easy. And I hope I've, hope I've got enough RPG rockets for it. Darling, do you not feel a special connection between us? A certain magic? No, and I'll be honest with you, you're not really my type. Gotta go. Barry, is everything sorted for tonight? Mate, seriously, of course it's bloody sorted. You're going to blow them away. Hmm. Well, I'm more worried about someone blowing me away. Oh, there's talk of blowing! Well, listen, sweetheart, please take out your many frustrations on Barry with you and leave me alone. Barry? I've had Barry. Everyone has. Do what? I like a challenge. Phil is joking. Parry? Mm. Listen, Phil. <laughs> Stop taking the mic. Yes, last year in Monaco. What? Too much champagne. No, there wasn't. Too much love in the air. No, there wasn't. You'd better shoot it. It's lies, Phil. But it was beautiful. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Now, Barry, we're safe, right? Safe? The best security geezer in town has just turned up. Would I lie to you, kid? Yes, actually. All the time? Well, this time I'm not. Vic, would I lie to him? Probably. <sighs> We'd better go to wardrobe. Vic, do us a favour. Go check the concert hall is clear. Mr Superstar Soppy Bollocks here is going all showbiz on me. Sure. Hey, I wasn't the one finding true love in Monaco. Oh, shut it till you'll be finding a new manager. Hey, don't tempt me. I just love those two. <laughs> they are delicious. So in San Andreas we had Kent, Paul and Macker. In this game we have uh, <laughs> Phil Collins and Barry. Okay, very tight time limit. 17.30, right. So as mentioned earlier, there are enemies in pretty awkward locations in this mission. So, <laughs> this is not going to be pretty whatsoever. Piss off Hermes. Piss off everybody. Right, round the corner. Good. Oi! Get out of my face. Right. And I have to equip a gun because there's an enemy with a gun right in front of you as soon as you go inside the stadium. But luckily he's... Uh, Fighting a guard, so you've got a chance to pop a cap in his ass. Told you, right. And always take the bike. Otherwise you will definitely run out of time. Right, 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 right. Oh, shit! Come on then. Oh, they're coming towards me, hell. Yeah. 
I didn't think I was that close. <laughs> okay, well that's good to know. I can kill both of those enemies from uh, behind the wall, it seems. Uh, quickly grab the blue and furnace. Yes, we. If this mission proves to be too difficult, I'll uh, do the next mission for Lance instead, taking the fall. Um, you know, I'm thinking about taking over a site from the bikers in downtown. It's give me a save point which is a bit closer to the studios. Come on, you have to work quickly. Right, come on, come on, come on. And by the way, the chocolate egg is being constructed in this game. Yep. It has like a, a mini crane beside it. Okay, piss off. Wintergreen. Yep, there's at least three new bikes in this game. The Wintergreen, the Ventoso, that's the new moped. And the Street Fighter, that's Martinez's bike. And there's also the VCPD Wintergreen, so there's four. There might be more new bikes in this game than that, but I can't actually remember. Okay, here we go again. Oh my god. Oh my god. Well, so much for him being uh, focused on the guard and not Vic. Jesus. Not good. Not good at all. Okay. Right, on this occasion, I'll speed it up until I'm back at the stadium. Right, am I going to get shot again? <laughs> Probably. No, actually. Makes a change. Right. Yeah, I always thought that uh, that guy always killed the guard first. Well, clearly that is not the case. Wow. Right. I wonder if I can, uh, oh you reloaded. I can chuck a Molotov in. Oh hell. Rocket launcher it is then. Without getting killed. There, right, keep moving. It's a very tight time limit. Any enemies rush you? Yes. Take him down. Right. I'll just snipe these guys. He's not got a very uh, high rate of fire, does he? Well done. I took a chance and it paid off. Let's go. Come on. Go, 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 go. Pedal this thing, Vic. Come on. Right, this is the hardest. No, the hardest part is actually the bit in the basement, I'd say. But 
this bit's not so easy either. But I think it might be possible to... Uh... Mm, shit. I was going to say... It might be possible to blow some of them up from behind the wall, you know? Shit. Shot me through the fucking curtain. Jesus. Right, you know what? <clears throat> um, I think I'll just move on to taking the fall for Lance. Because that mission really does suck. Let me get a quicker car first. And I'll save at my high roller drug site down south. Fuck off. And hey, while I'm there, I'll be able to get some more rocket launcher ammo. I've got the money, I might as well. Even though I still haven't completed Phil Cassidy's shooting range challenge yet to decrease the gun costs. Yeah, now we're flying. And we will be flying again in the next mission, literally. Yep. Taking the fall involves a helicopter. I've got a better comet than you. I guess I'll uh, cut across here. <laughs> Excuse me. Doink. I can't tell if he's saying I'm going to get some brothers or I'm going to get some rubbers. Sounds like rubbers to me. Okay. Okay. Kill Phil part two can wait. Next up, taking the fall. <laughs> yeah, I'm Lance T. Vance, baby. T for tulips in Thailand. Great. <laughs> yeah, look, I gotta go. All right, <laughs> later. So, who was that? Oh, bro, that's just the accountant. He's getting us a better rate at cleaning the money. And you call the accountant baby? Well, yeah, I'm a friendly guy, and baby is slang, you know, I don't love him, I ain't like that. Yeah, hey, <laughs> whatever you say. Anyway, we got real things to worry about. Someone's been helping themselves to the stash. The Mendez is a freaking out, and I told him we'd take care of it. Ah, uh, uh, it's the last thing I need on top of everything else. What are you talking about? What's wrong? Oh, man, it's just Louise. I really thought we had something, but we just don't get to see each other. Yeah. You know? Well, you know, relationships can be tough. Believe me, I know. <laughs> uh-huh. Yep. Hey, come on, man. We, we got some fees to deal with. And you could take out your sexual frustrations on them. <laughs> hey, come on. Let's pop. Yeah. You know I love you, bro. Aye. So who's been stealing the yayo? What? Oh, yeah, uh, it's the bikers. You sure? Yeah, of course I am. You don't look it. Well, I guess I'm just gonna have to prove it to you. You do the flying, I'll do the frying. <laughs> The helicopter's engine isn't even on. Why are you shouting? The pair of you. Especially Lance. Okay. So the first part is dead simple. But uh, once I'm on foot, that's when things are going to get tough. There are more enemies in 
awkward locations. Just like Kill Phil Part 2. Hotel, which is under construction in this game. I'm so good, I'm bad. bad to the bone. B -b 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 bad. I don't think I've ever been shot through the windscreen while flying the helicopter in this mission. Well, there's a first time for everything. Who knows, maybe it's not possible. I'd like to think it's not. Well, just don't get too close and you'll be fine. Okay. Oh. One Lance. The balance meter was full, you should have been hitting him. Them, whatever. That's a bit more like it. Vancerator. Okay. And now for part two. Jeez, talk about crash and burn. Right. So I don't know how close they are to that wall, that's the only problem. Let me see. No. Nope. Hmm, only got five rockets left to make them count. Right, they've got quite good accuracy and range, so I need to be extra careful. I'm mean, gonna... I think I might just, uh... Yeah, I'll go around the back. If I can? Yeah. Of course I can. Okay. Uh, I can't see him because of that great big tube. Can I get that guy? Looks like it. Oh. Yes, I can. Nice one. I could do some more SMG ammo. Which I'm not going to get yet. No, I still can't see them. Can now. Good. Oh. Who shot at me? No clue. Right, here comes the hard part. Mm. I think the rest of the enemies are, yeah, in the building. This is where it gets very tough. As you can hear, <laughs> please don't get shot through the wall. Jesus. Um, I don't even know if it's possible to bring a car up these ramps, because I was thinking about doing a drive-by on them. Well, hopefully the mission won't fail if I go too far away. not using the van because that probably won't even make it up the ramps. And I'm not using a bike, that's for sure. God no. Let me 
find a fast car. Uh, preferably not a stallion. Yeah, I don't know if the mission... F Let's get a, a cop car, yeah. I was going to get a Polaris V8 from the brothel, but... Oh, shit. Okay. Jeez. Okay. I suppose I could try to bring the van up then. Cause I'm, I reckon as soon as I walk into that room, I'm just going to get shot. Nah. No way. No way. Shit. Oh my god. <laughs> Oh, this sucks. Yeah, if I try to run over there, I'm just going to get shot. And something went boom. What was that? Are they blowing themselves up? Hopefully. It'll uh, make my job easier. It's a shame it's not the guys who are up ahead. What if I tried to reverse the van up? Will that make a difference? I highly doubt it. No. To be honest, I probably wouldn't even get a fucking cop car up there. Hmm. What if I just got a bike? How would I get on? Was there not a bike? Okay, yeah, right there. Okay. Yeah, the problem is, well, yes, I can get the bike up the ramp a lot more easily than a car or a van, etc., etc., but uh, I'm a much bigger target when on a bike. I'm just going to get shot. Unless I can find somewhere to hide. Yeah, see, I told you, you as soon as you go in there, you just get turned into Swiss cheese. Hmm. I just thought of something else I could try. But the problem is... If I go too far away, just drive with this. If I go too far away to get a helicopter, the mission will fail. Hmm. See, taking the fall is just as hard as Kill Phil Part 2, unfortunately. I forgot to get more rocket launcher ammo. Right, I'll speed the video up until I'm back at the hotel. Right, so... The th thing that I was curious about earlier on was... Is it not possible to snipe those guys who are up ahead when you reach the top of the ramp? It might be possible. Yeah, emphasis on might be possible. And I hope it's possible. Excuse me. Uh. Oh, good. I can 
can still get that guy from here, right? No, because I can't see his head. I need to go a bit further back. Oh, come on. There we go. Okay. Yeah, I wonder if it's possible to use the ramp over there to get up there and then shoot through that hole in the wall. Oh, shit, I'm being shot at. Don't think I didn't hear that. Oh, shit. Right. I need to go a bit further back, otherwise they will hit me. Right, then there's the guy behind the red van. Shit. And he's got a bead on me. Then again, I've got a bead on him. Yeah. Let me see if I can go up here. And I might be able to use a van to get extra height. So the problem is I would get a helicopter, but if I go to the police station... Nah, that's just not going to work. Yeah, if I go to the police station to get said helicopter, the mission will fail because I went too far away from Lance. Hmm. It's a tricky one, this one. Very tricky. Well, they haven't started shooting at me yet. What happens if I try to go... a certain distance away from the building now? Do I still get warned about leaving the area? Probably. Yes, okay. Well, let's see, how far away can you go? before the mission fails. Not very far at all. Ah, oh, that sucks. That really sucks. Mm. Oh dear. Right. Right, just one question. Can you get out of the helicopter at this point in the mission? You can. How interesting. Right. So I'm going to see what happens if I move the police helicopter. To the grass outside the hotel. But then again, is it actually possible to see through that hole in the wall from this rooftop? A quick look. Unless that blue thing that I'm seeing is the other side of the building. It could be, right. Um, I'll leave this helicopter. Bloody hell. Yeah, I'll leave this helicopter here. And hopefully it stays there. Right. 
Come on, all I did was look behind. All I did was look behind. Yeah, for some reason the game decided to crash when I looked behind. Wow, that's a new one. Right, I'll speed it up again until I'm back at the downtown police station. I, I just want to see if that police helicopter disappears or not after leaving it on the grass. Is it still there? Yes. But the real question is, will it still be there after the cutscene in which Lance and Vic are out of the helicopter? And my other strategy is to use the sniper rifle to carefully peek around a corner. So I remember that worked on a couple of occasions during my San Andreas OHKO playthrough. Whether or not it'll work in this playthrough, I don't know. There's only one way to find out. Okay. Uh, how do you get out of this place? Look at that. Look at that. How interesting. Okay, so I can use a helicopter. But am I actually able to see the enemies inside the building? Right, I'm not leaving the area. You silly. I'm not leaving the area. Well, let me take out these dudes first, okay? No, that's not an enemy. Use the red arrows. And don't look behind, please. Because the game, for some reason, doesn't like it. <laughs> that's a first. No, actually. Who's shooting me? Uh, a biker, who else? Stop getting smart with me. Okay, it's not him. Yeah, let me just take out all the ground enemies first. And then I'll see if the helicopter strap actually works or not. Dead meat from LCS, anyone? Does your master like a Sicilian sausage? Or is it spicy sausage? I'm surprised he didn't shoot at me. Okay. Right. And now for the ones in the side. Well, good luck. Let's get the chopper. I can't remember where I left the damn thing. Okay. I was getting worried that it might have vanished. Thankfully, nope. Right. Tell me the mission doesn't fail if I land the helicopter on that building over here. Well, I haven't got the warning message yet. Okay. Do, 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 do. I can't see a thing. No. Well, hey, you can't blame me for trying. Oh, well. 
It is what it is. I was just uh, scoping out the situation. Right. I am so finished. <laughs> can I cannot shoot him through the... F I can! Wow! I didn't expect that. Right, he's behind that pillar. It doesn't look like the bullets can pass through that pillar. Or even between the little gap. Oh, there you are. Good. Uh, there is a barrel which I would quite like to take out. I know this seems a bit too cautious and too tentative, but it's not. There's no such thing as being too cautious or tentative in a playthrough like this. Right, if I can just inch over a wee bit, I might be able to hit that barrel. That I can. I don't know if I got any enemies I wasn't looking at the radar beforehand to see how many there were before I hit the barrel. Right. There are at least four left, I think. I was thinking about blowing up that bike with the rocket launcher. One wrong move and I'm dead. <laughs> no doubt about it. Sniper bullets aren't passing through anything. Yeah, there's the guy in the back right corner who's able to see me as well. If I can get both of them to reload at the same time, that'll be ideal. Can I get him? I might. Nah. Oh, oh, oh. Come on, take him out, take him out, take him out. Well done. Okay. No, I need... Oh, he did reload. That's just typical, that. Right, as soon as he reloads again, I'll blast him. With the AK. If I can get him from here, that is. Using the RPG and snipers too risky. Uh oh, oh shit! Oh no! <laughs> I was too far away. I couldn't get him. Ah. Okay, let's try again. Ah, oh, so close. Well, at least I know it can be done. I know this can be done. Ah, but that guy in the back right was just a bit too far away from me to be able to hit him. 
with the AK-47. Yeah, I was hoping to lock on to him, but it, I didn't. I didn't get a lock. I was too far away from him. Okay, fine. Fine. And here we go again. Where have I seen this place before? Right, so... <laughs> so the sniper rifle is my best friend in this mission, clearly. Okay. Yeah, it's just a real shame that they... I was just a bit too far away from that biker to be able to get a lock with my AK-47. Ah, if he was just a wee bit closer. I mean, I was too scared to use the sniper rifle and the rocket launcher because, well, you can't uh, lock on with those weapons. I mean, at least with uh, the AK-47. You're guaranteed a lock if you're close enough, that is. And that guy could have killed me. Right. I can see him a lot more clearly now. Yeah. Makes a change. And then there's these guys, bloody hell. They're both shooting me. Okay. Okay, so the sniper rifle strap did work in the previous attempt. Here's hoping it continues to serve me well. Okay. One false move. Mission failed. So be careful. Yeah, I was able to get one of them through the wall, wasn't I? Yeah. Surprisingly. Yeah, that guy. I can't remember how I did it though. Ah. Did I get him? I did. Yep, yeah, there's his gun. Good. Good shot. Right, the next guy's behind. The pillars. I think they're pipes, actually. Aha! Got him. Not so lucky, Mr. Biker. Alright, let me get the red bottle. Outlast. Yeah, I didn't have to. But this bit, ooh. Right, hold on. Let me step back a bit. And then ever so slightly keep inching to the left. Until I'm able to see him. Without getting shot unexpectedly. Good, well done. Yes, yeah, so what to do is keep firing the sniper rifle and the camera will shake around a bit and that allows you to get a good shot, a clean shot at the enemy. Okay, that guy in the back right isn't shooting at me this time, that's good. Okay, so now it's just the ones behind the walls, I think. I think there's still two left, unfortunately. Nice. No double explosions, I hope. Nah, we're good. At last, taking the fall is complete, everybody. Are you there? Hey, Beck! Look what I found! You're alive! I thought you were dead. No, man! I landed on a few soft bikers! Now I got me a new bike! Yeah! Never mind that. Where's the stolen coke? Ah, uh, yeah! Uh, they probably sold it already, the bastards! I'll see you later, bro! In other words, Lance was telling porkies. I don't even know why I bother sometimes. <laughs> Our product is still going missing. Don't fuck with us, Vic. Resolve this situation. 
Right, allow me to save and then I will BRB. Whew, me. So it was all about the sniper rifle. Don't need a helicopter. Yeah, turns out you can't even see those bikers from up there anyway. Kill Phil Part 2 can still wait till later. Oh yeah. Let me just save at the brothel down here and then I'll BRB. Next mission for Lance is White Lies. Things get a bit emotional in that mission. Okay. There we go. It's all about problem solving, finding strategies that work best. Time to BRB. I'll save again at uh, my high roller drug site. I need to see how much RPG ammo I have. Because I still want to use it for uh, Kill Phil Part 2. I think the nastiest part of Kill Phil Part 2 is the basement section. Followed closely by the bit at the stage because well, you can't see the enemies but they can see you, sadly. Come on. Round the corner. Oh, quack. And there seems to be no recording session in this playthrough without at least one game crash. Bloody hell, all I did was look behind. When I was on foot. Jeez, I couldn't believe that. Right, how much do I have? Let's get some more. Hopefully that'll be enough. Oi! Shit off! Now, on the PSP version of the game, which I'm playing, um, <clears throat> there's a minor glitch at the very start of White Lies. The hovercraft doesn't accelerate forward at the very start, but there's a very, very, very simple solution. Just put it in reverse. Yep, put it in reverse. And for some reason, that solves it. So this is where the coke is going? Up your nose? Hey, Vic. Hey, Vic. Uh, what are you doing here? You had me running around town like a psycho, and all the while you're siphoning it off for your personal use. You are unbelievable. Hey, I'm, I'm sorry. Uh, look, can, can we talk about this later? Oh, <laughs> hey, Vic. <laughs> Shit. Louise, what the hell is going on? Well, uh, um, uh, uh, bro. Hey, hey, bro, it ain't nothing like that. I wouldn't do that to you. I just needed something to take my mind off things. So you fucked my brother? No! no. We just get high together. God damn, you are so judgmental, like you're a damn saint or something. Why are you being such an asshole? You are a mess. And you're wonderful. A wonderful drug dealing, thieving oh, murderer. Come on, guys. I was doing it for us. Who are you trying to kid? You don't give a shit about me. Not now, I don't. You know what? You make me want to puke, you self-righteous dick! Ah, get lost! Stay away from me, you sick bastard! You're a phony, Vic Vance! What are you gonna do? Thanks a lot, Lance! What? Listen! Who cares? It's my coke! It's all my coke! And I'll do with it whatever I damn well please. 
Let's come back here. Shut up! You're always telling me what to do. But if it wasn't for me, we wouldn't have any of this. If I want to take coke, I will. If I want to give it away, I will. And I'm going to give it away. All of it. And you can't stop me. Lance, don't be stupid. And yeah, uh, yeah. Oh, okay. Reverse it into the water. I think that's how it's actually solved. But yeah, reverse it into the water. That should make it go forward. Right, hurry up before they vanish, as in the packages. Quickly now. The mission fails if you don't collect enough. Yeah, I think you, you can miss an, you can miss a small amount, but uh, not too much, mind you. Oh crap! Yeah, reverse the hovercraft into the water to fix the no acceleration glitch. Oh shit! I suspect I'm going to fail the mission. That's three I've failed to pick up. Uh, there's a nasty part in this mission, by the way. It's the bit after the footbridge section right here. Yeah, there's a nasty dip into the water. Oh, well done. Yeah, remember, if you get submerged when in a vehicle in this game, you do lose health, and that includes the hovercraft right here, unfortunately. Other than that, this mission is pretty straightforward, just don't miss too many packages. I'm not sure how many you need to miss in order to fail the mission. Hopefully it's not, uh, <laughs> three. Yes, don't miss any more, alright? Also, Lance, have you not noticed Vic following you around in this hovercraft? Yeah, the coke really has been going up Lance's nose. Come on, please say I've not failed the mission. Please say I've not failed the mission. I don't think we're too far from the end now, unfortunately. <clears throat> Come on. Fuck! Fuck! Come on, in the water. Ah, oh, come on, pick it up. Pick it up! Bloody hell. I got stuck on the fucking fence on that pier. Shit, that was annoying. Oh, man. Hey, Vic, I'm back in town. How's that lady of yours? Think I might pay her a visit. Pause off, dickhead. Right, I'll save again. The next mission is where it hurts most, and that one involves combat. And a time limit as well. Right. Let's take the black and red Bover 64 to my drug site without getting a nightstick shoved halfway up my ass. Ah! Am I okay? Yeah, I'm fine.
I think I'll take lances in fairness. Right. No cinematic cutscenes in this mission, by the way. Oh man, what month is? Did I do anything stupid in the last few days? Stupid? Oh, no, 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 you passed stupid and kept on going. Straight on into fucked up! Lance? It's Louise, where's Vic? I need him. It's me, Louise. What is it? Vic? Oh, thank God. It's that Martinez. He must think we're still an item. Yeah? Well, we're not. For crying out loud, Vic, I didn't sleep with Lance. We're just friends, which is more than you've been lately. You never call. We never see each other. Is this going somewhere? I just wanted you to know that Martinez's thugs have been following me, and because I want to get back together, I'm trying to avoid being killed. And now I'm hiding out around the back of some stupid burger bar, not that you give a shit. What? Martinez sent guys after you? I don't even know why I called. I'm gonna kick their asses myself. Wait, 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 Louise! Louise! Lance, you wanna help me out? <sighs> Forget it. Lance, you wanna help out? Stupidest question you've ever asked, Vic. Right, luckily, after the cutscene at the burger bar, your vehicle remains in memory. Which is good because after that cutscene, that's when the time limit begins. <laughs> and what language was that, Stu? Uh, crazy for games-ish? Right, I'm gonna get a new car. Because that one took a shit ton of damage from that stupid-ass crash right there. Come on, some time to do. You can jack me, bitch? Oh fuck, he's gonna fucking kick me in the face, isn't he? No! No! You shite monger! Bloody hell. And I bet the enemies that you have to fight in where it hurts most are gonna be a lot easier to kill compared to that douchebag behind the wheel of that car. What a fucking tosser. In, please, no, Victor. Right. God, that felt good. Stu? Yes? Is that going in the highlight reel? Absolutely not. I'm joking. I'm joking. Next question, Stu. Yes? Highlight reels when? Good things come to those who wait. Stu. What is it now? Why can you never give a straight answer to a simple question? <laughs> Excuse me, that was a straight answer. Anyway, not too far from the burger bar now. Right, let's not wreck this car. Please. Okay, I'm fine, I'm fine. Right, make sure you leave the door open. Uh, I should be able to just uh, knock the doors off with my fists, actually. And you can do running attacks in this game, but only with your fists. With uh, other melee weapons, you can't. Strangely. Right, and luckily, only cops drag you out of the passenger seat. Other enemies only drag you out of the driver's seat. Bitch, she's my 
Martinez is now. And you're gonna be ours. I parked my car in the wrong place. Your hair looked real good on my wall. So it disappeared anyway. Shit. Out the way. Oh, I looked behind. The game didn't crash that time. Wow. Makes a nice change. Right, let's get something fast. Uh, I'll get the Pilatus V8 quickly. Is that a cop car? That isn't a cop bike. Yes, it is, unfortunately. As soon as I heard that engine, I had a horrible... F Where's the Pilatus? There should be a Pilatus V8 outside that site, and there's not. Why? Fucking hell. You have got to be shitting me. I'm against the clock here. Well, if it makes you feel any better, your wanted level's gone away. Right, where Louise is, is always random. Thank God that was a biker and not a... Ah, oh, not again. Okay, fine. For those enemies, I'll snipe them. I will fast forward the video until I'm back at the biker bar. I mean, the burger bar. My head is all over the joint right now. Tell you what, I'll park it there this time. And hopefully it won't vanish. And it did, unfortunately. Well, whenever I played this mission in a practice run, it didn't disappear. Ah, oh, fine. Oh good. He's not yanking me out of my car. Well, hello, Polaris V8. So nice of you to join us. Dick. I only want it because it's a quick car. Not as quick as a sports car, but it's still quick enough. Okay. Now you'll know where Louise is when you go near one of the blue blips and you hear Vic shouting, Louise! Right. Oh, crap. Can you still hit me from there? Well, he's not shooting at me anymore, so no. Uh, yep, one guy there. Right. In we go. Don't run me over! Jesus. You wonder sometimes, honestly. Right. I don't think there are any more enemies here. Right, if she... Yeah, surely if she was there, Vic would have shouted Louise by now. Get the bike. Hopefully she's not in the third one. Bloody hell, that could have ended in disaster. Right. Any enemies? Not in that alley. Oh god. No idea if that killed anybody or not. I don't think she's there somehow. So I head up to the northernmost location instead. And the location in question is um, that alley beside Hyman Condo. Yeah, I reckon if Louise was back there, Vic could have shouted Louise. Right. Okay, they're not shooting at me yet. Oh, shit. The fuzz. 
Hurry up. Louise keeps losing health even after you've found the car that she's in. You know what? Fuck it. I'm just gonna get in this. And I'll drive by them. Or try to. Come on. I don't think she's here. Oh, she is. Good. Bloody hell. <sighs> Lucky. Oh, bloody hell. Hey, everything's gonna be okay. Nick, I knew you'd come. I think I need a doctor. I need some help over here. Come on, get a doctor. Hi. <laughs> Bloody hell. Lance needs something as well. Yeah, like what? A brain? What else? Louise is real sweet to me, man. Tell her I'll see her again real soon.